Hello and welcome to Low Budget Gaming and welcome to some big news. So I opened Steam earlier today and saw this and I did not even pay attention. I was moving on and then suddenly I did a double take because Diablo is coming to Steam on the 17th of October. Now 17th of October is the start of season two in Diablo. So I think they chose that date so that it launches at the same time here. Um, I guess this is a good move overall. I was expecting this, although not this soon. And also I was expecting this to arrive on Game Pass before arriving on Steam. So it is a little surprising, but I guess with Game Pass people can play it for free. Uh, on Steam people will have to buy it of course. So maybe they thought this would be a better idea. And if this fails and they still can't get more people in, they'll probably put this on um, Game Pass as well. Now there was a developer live stream uh, last night I was watching it and they did announce it in that but I had sort of stopped halfway because there's so much stuff in there they have overhauled the game massively for season two there's so many changes so many updates so many quality of life improvements I was getting a bit uh, sleepy I thought I'll read the patch notes or whatever later on so this is coming to Steam and that is good but I wanted to also share some ideas of things I would like to see besides just dropping it on Steam. They are saying it will be cross-play, cross-progression, but I went through the uh, dev stream carefully and I did not see anybody mention the fact that if you already own the game on Battle.net, you don't have to buy it again on Steam. And knowing Blizzard, they're probably going to make you buy again, which obviously I'm not an idiot to do. I'll stick to Battle.net if that is the case. But people who have bought the game on Battle.net if they want to move to Steam, they should be able to just move without having to pay again. That would be really idiotic to make them pay again. But it is Blizzard, so it is possible. They haven't thought that through because they did not mention this part specifically. So I'll maybe watch the dev stream again because I did not finish it. I just saw the announcement part. There was also a Q&A section, so I'll go through that again to double check if um, you can get it, if you already have it on uh, battle.net if not i'll still play on battle.net the other thing i would like to see is some sort of a regional price obviously because this is uh let's see a 70 dollar game for the standard and there's the ultimate for 100 and there's one in between at 90 or something as well so first of all they should reduce the price i feel regional price would be nice because if they slap a 5000 uh, rupees here like the other 70 dollar games i think that's just stupid it defeats the purpose so put some regional price on it because normally a $60 game on Steam is uh, about 3000 in India so if they can put it at 3000 or maybe a little below and also start with a bit of a discount that will make life a lot easier and may attract a lot of people because if you read the updates and the patch notes they've actually gone over it in great detail I don't know if you can see it here yeah they have put in a lot of stuff for season two. A lot of little improvements, a lot of UI improvements, a lot of inventory management updates, so many little tweaks and improvements that I'm expecting this to be a little bit better, a lot better, hopefully. And see, all of this uh, is being added, new additions, new improvements, new end game bosses, all, the, all that sort of thing. So there is a lot happening, but if they are still greedy with the usual stuff, like making people buy the game again that would be just stupid because i would prefer if i can just move to steam and just keep playing the game on steam instead of having another launcher again because this is the only game i have from battle.net if they add uh, this to steam and i can just you know move over i'll just uninstall battle.net i don't need to have it ready my accounts are linked and i'm good to go so hopefully they do that um regional price would be nice and also if they start with a small sale that would be good as well like put at least a 25 30 percent sale to get more people in so yeah uh, i don't know what to make of this it is something i was expecting maybe not this soon like i said and i don't know if this is going to attract a lot more people because the general sentiment is still very negative around this game so i'm not expecting a huge uh, uh, you know change at least initially but hopefully if the improvements are really good if the updates as they say here if they actually make a big difference then the player base might increase and more people might turn up. But I'm expecting like day one, this to be full of 
overwhelmingly negative reviews like people will be review bombing now that they have a chance on uh, steam so it will be interesting but like i said if you saw my video on the other channel where i did a review for this the game is pretty good i'm, I'm not against the game it's just all the little monetization and the greedy tactics they use unnecessary you know shop with cosmetics very expensive cosmetics and they also have a battle pass again battle pass i don't mind but it's a full paid price game and so yeah give a bit of regional price put a bit of a discount uh, get more people in and obviously people who want to move from battle.net hopefully they get uh, the game for free but yeah uh, let me know what you think um i know most people are not fans of this but i did like the game the campaign was good the story was good uh, the movement everything else was good i had played the beta well before the game came out and i did like it so I'm, I'm okay with this. I'll continue playing the seasons. It doesn't take too long to finish the battle pass. A couple of weeks maybe. So I'll just jump in every season, finish the battle pass and then move on to other things. But yeah, uh, it's good to see this coming to Steam. Anyway, thank you for watching. Just wanted to share this quick update. See you next time.